Whoa, that is so cool. I spent $800 at Costco. This is something like Kim Kardashian would do. Hey guys, it's my family here. Make sure to subscribe to be part of the family. I read every single one of my comments, so comment something down below. 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 Today I'm gonna to be doing like a grocery haul and also kitchen organization because I bought a lot of groceries and my kitchen isn't organized, so that's what we're gonna to do today. Today I went to Costco and I spent um, a little bit over $800, which is kind of like really a lot. I'm, I think it'll last me a while. Also, I had to stand in the cold ass line to get into Costco, so y'all better appreciate this. Costco baby! Currently, I'm grocery shopping in Costco. We had to stand in this long like line. 10, 15 minutes, but it was cold, guys. I don't think you guys understand. Like, it's cold up in Canada. And we're also wearing like nothing. Like, I'm not wearing a shirt under this. My nipples be cold right, right now. I'm getting some groceries. Also, just got a blender. I'm shopping at Costco because I can freeze most of the stuff and I don't have to go to the grocery store quite often. So. Uh, I think I think I'm good for the next like year. I just spent Went to buy a TV at Costco. There isn't a TV because we didn't buy a TV. Instead, we bought $1,000 worth of other things. Nice. Oh my God, the line's so short. When we were here, the line was like back there. It was cold, guys. It was cold. So I'm gonna show you guys kind of what I got and then we'll get on to organizing the kitchen and everything like that. We got some mangoes. I got some greener ones so that they would last longer. I love mangoes. Mangoes are like one of my favorite foods. And then I got butter because I always run out of butter. A lot of ground beef because I can just freeze a lot of this and then use it for like spaghetti. I got like four packs of bacon, which my brother's cooking in one up right now. Some blueberries for fruit. Mushrooms for chicken alfredo. Some blueberry bagels. Also be able to freeze this. I got two things of bread, which I'll be freezing one of them. Plain bagels because these slap with butter, smack with butter, I don't know, smack, slap. Bunch of minced garlic because I don't want to be cutting up garlic, so this will be nice to be able to just like, Put a spoonful in. I got a bunch of crispy apple chips because these are like my favorite snack and it's been my favorite since I was so young. Some pretzel chips because these are just good to snack on. I just got this because like it has the most variety and I honestly don't really eat chips that much, so this is good. I love the sun chips and Doritos. Alfredo sauce because I literally make Alfredo probably twice a week. And then I also just got some tomato and basil sauce for like spaghetti and stuff. Oh. Fuck me. I got a bunch of solo cups because once this uh, pandemic is over, you know, you gotta have some solo cups for some pong and everything like that. Bunch of chicken breasts because they go bad pretty easily, so I thought I would just get the frozen ones. And this is just nice for like literally anything. Chicken is, yeah. Yeah, chicken is chicken. And I got this blender. It was only $80, and I just like to make smoothies and stuff like that, so. Banana chocolate muffins, which I'll be freezing, like, some of these. Blueberry muffins, just to snack on for the morning. Also, a bunch of croissants. Gonna freeze these, too. Then I got some chocolate-covered raisins, just because I crave chocolate. And I don't want to buy, like, chocolate bars, so like, this will just be nice to, like, slowly snack a on. A bunch of cucumbers for, like, salads and stuff like that. Broccoli, which I didn't want to buy this, but they just put it in my cart. I already bought these broccoli, so I'm just gonna freeze all of this just to, like, add, because, like, I need vegetables in my diet before I die. Got some strawberries, chocolate covered strawberries are so good. Spinach, which I'll be freezing all of this actually just to put in smoothies. Got some romaine lettuce to make salads, but like this is so much. Oh my God, I'm so excited for this. This is a hazelnut vanilla coffee and I'm starting to make coffee at home now since like I don't want to drive to go get coffee. Hazelnut and vanilla are my favorite combination. So the fact that I found these, I need to figure out how to grind coffee beans though because I don't know how. Obviously there's a machine, but like I want to figure out where I can buy one. Then, oh. I just dropped a cucumber. Then I got some cheese. Costco cheese is like the best cheese because like it doesn't have like that weird powder around it. I just got some shrimp for salad rolls and then also shrimp alfredo. Got some feta cheese for Greek salads. I love feta cheese so much. I'm not like a huge fan of cheese, but feta cheese. Then I got some more Kodiak cakes, power cakes. This is like the best pancake or like waffle mix you can get because you get so much protein out of it. So it's like not like unhealthy for you if that makes sense. Love this if like I'm trying to get protein in for breakfast. Once I start going to the gym again, I love eating. I'm just cooking these up right now, but I got some sausage rounds because they're just good. I got this for my drawer. I only got one of them because I store my utensils in actually like one of these holders. I'll show you guys. But this is just hold like my scissors, and like measuring stuff. So this is what I hold all my utensils in and it works great. And I got that from Urban Barn. These Q-tips, this will last me a long time. I bought this. DHC deep cleansing oil because I want to be able to like remove my makeup without having to use like makeup wipes. I've heard using a cleansing oil and then using another cleanser works really well, so I think this will be good. Then I got a bunch of Ziploc freezer bags just so that I can like separate everything and put them in the freezer so it takes up less room. Got and a big thing of micellar water 
just remove like eye makeup. And then I got a bunch of cotton rounds. I want to look into getting the reusable ones where you like wash them. And now I just have this, but I would like to look into the reusable ones. These are a blessing. If you guys live in an apartment or something or you're renting and you guys can't put holes in the wall, this holds up everything. These are these commands. I use this for my heavy ass mirror in my room and everything. This works so well. And then I got a sack of potatoes. Make mashed potatoes because I love mashed potatoes and gravy. Then I got, this is Anila's, but this is uh, just like a duvet because she needs a new one. Some new toothpaste because I ran this out. This is charcoal, which I'm kind of like iffy about. I was debating on getting it because charcoal ruins your enamel, but I think that this doesn't have like enough in to it to ruin your enamel. I, think. I just got two more pillows in my room and then I have to have more in the guest room. That is the haul. I'm going to put this on the fridge without organizing it and then I need to open up a bunch of my Amazon boxes, bo bo boxes and then organize everything everything in there but for now I'm just gonna throw everything in and then we'll do the organization after. I also just bought this like place on top of the stove and I think it's gonna be so good for breakfast making pancakes and stuff whoa that's gonna be so nice for making breakfast okay so I'm going to assemble this into here now basically I just have a bunch of random scissors and stuff that I want to put in here um, what the I don't like this setup That's gonna have to do for now. Several days later. Okay, so it's about two weeks later now, and I still haven't unboxed any of the kitchen stuff or organized it. So today I'm gonna be doing that. But I need to go to Walmart again. I know I went to Costco just like not that long ago in the vlog, but it's been two weeks because Anila and I ran out of like all the fresh foods, like lettuce and stuff like that. So we need to go get and that. just a couple other things. So I thought I would bring you guys along with me while we go do that. Let me show you guys a quick outfit of the day. So you know, I thought I might as well dress cute since uh, I don't have anywhere else to go and like get a picture. But I'm going for like kind of like more of like a muted like nude kind These of. These shoes are off-white. These pants are from Princess Polly. This belt is from Brandy. This jacket is from Brandy. And then this shirt is from Princess Polly. Super cute, but definitely way too extra for Walmart. Okay, we are in the Walmart parking lot. I made a list of everything we need to get, which is like a bunch of vegetables and just like milk and stuff like that. And just some hooks from my bathroom to hang on my robes. But other than that, we don't need much. We literally spent so much money last week that we don't really to need to buy too much now. Wow, 77 cents cucumbers. Look how oh, massive these bags are. Oh my god. I'm getting a mini shovel to pick up Ling Ling's shit on the deck. Because it's like in piles right now. Mm -hmm. Finally, after coming here, they have Uno. I've been looking for Uno for the longest time, but it's always been sold oh, right. out. <laughs> What if this whole time I bet you it's it been there. here and we just didn't look? I bet you it was there. We are dumb bitch. Of course, got a hand sanitize the phone. And yes, that is Harry Styles is my background. Okay, so we are home now. I just unboxed a bunch of the things from Amazon. Yeah, I don't know why I got so many of these turntables, but we definitely need to get more snacks and stuff like that. But since it's just us two, we like make full ass meals. But when quarantine's like over and stuff like that, and then we have like people over all the time, it'll be nice to have a bunch of snacks for people to eat. We also just got some more glasses. I have all of these. This is for like different vegetables and stuff. This is for all the eggs. For all the cans, because she likes to drink a lot of like LaCroix. I'm gonna organize the kitchen right now. I'm gonna put all my little eggies in here. This was meant to be. That's all the eggs. That was meant to be. If it's meant to be, it'll be, it'll be, <laughs> baby. Just let it be. This is something like Kim Kardashian would do. She probably has her own fucking chicken farm in her bag. I bought this bin specifically for strawberries, but I don't have it. So I'm putting my mushrooms in it. Boom. I feel so bougie doing this. Like, I don't think you guys understand. We got mushrooms. Eggs. Wow, we bought new glasses for only $12. I'm gonna put the tomatoes, tomatoes in here. Tomato, a tomato. Boom, we got our tomatoes. <laughs> Boom. Put our tomatoes in its little section. Y'all probably wanna slap the shit out of me right now. I feel like I'm a soccer mom that has nothing better to do while her kids are at school. And she likes to organize her limes and vegetables as pastime. Guys. I bought a cereal holder from online and it came in. I am so excited. Like these are the things you don't think about, but like if you went over to someone's house and you saw this with cereal, you'd be like, what? I love kitchen stuff. So like this makes me so excited. Right now we're at this smaller store sort of called Blush Lane. Walmart didn't have everything we needed. So we're just here getting a couple more things. That's so cute with the four box. Look at this. I feel like I'm in, in like a Canadian version of like Trader Joe's. This is so cute. We're at a new grocery store now because the last one didn't have what we needed. This one is so cool. It literally reminds me of Whole Foods and we don't have Whole Foods where I live. So this is so nice. Fucking plants. They have plants, Anila. And they have a bakery and they have someone making fresh pizza. 
I am in love with this store and like I don't think you guys realize how excited I am about this. This place is literal heaven. I'm at the peak of my happiness in my life right now and I'm not even over exaggerating. Oh my god, this store is the bread, best store ever. Salad. Wow. Bread. Garlic, Garlic bread. bread. This this right here, this L'Oreal Kids strawberry. That's Slow. Like the fact that they put lighting behind this is so cute. Like I could not get over how much I love this store. I watch all these American YouTubers talk about Dave's Killer Bread because it's so good for you, but it's not available anywhere where but I at live. This store, it is. I literally feel like I'm in Whole Foods or like a Trader Joe's right now, and I can't I've get seen, over it because I cannot. These. Ava Jules talks about that. Oh my god, and I've never seen them anywhere. I swear to. God, this store is gonna be like this is what's gonna keep me sane in life. This lighting, oh my god! And I've never seen this, but all the American YouTubers talk about it, and I've never been able to get it, so I am freaking out. Literally, her dream right here. Look, right, all this look, right. Oh my god, I can't get over it. Bro, there's a freaking cheese fridge. We're just driving around and we see this, like, that's so cute. That's so wholesome. We got some cereal to fill it up. This is all I aspire to have in my life. I cannot comprehend what my life is right now because I'm literally at the peak of my happiness and I'm like, I never say that stuff. And she's been with me since I was at like the lowest of my lows. So like, this is literally insane because going like, into that grocery store made me literally realize like, I don't know how, why that grocery store made me feel that way. It made me realize like how happy I am and I can't, I literally just can't stop talking about it because I don't understand it. Whoa, that is so cool. We got a bunch of berries. I'm gonna put them in these organizers. Guys, when I thought I couldn't get happier, look at the fridge, it's done. What? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. This fits so perfectly. Yeah, yeah. And then, oh my god, these organizers look so cute. I already cut up the celery, so like, if I want to eat it with ranch, it's super easy. And then all the fruits here, all the drinks. Anila is of legal age, so f off. And then the freezer has like everything. I cannot wait to make acai bowls because I got acai stuff. She just made some lasagna. We're cooking some. Oh, it's no, done. done. Some bread. Oh my god, this looks so good. I can't get over it. But we do have this huge mess of cardboard right here that we need to clean up. And the garage has a bunch of garbage in it. Garbage pickup comes on Wednesday, so we gotta get that situated for Wednesday. Uh, I just, I literally don't know what to tell you guys because I am. This is just all I've ever wanted. Dinner is soon. Okay, so I opened up this package and I was gonna build it and it's like this thing where you can like put your like towels in or whatever for the bathroom, right? Thought it'd be a great idea, but turns out I built it wrong and the screws won't come undone, so I just wasted a hundred dollars. But there's a huge mess going on and we're gonna clean this up. Just had a cup of coffee and this day has been very long. That's it for this moving vlog. The next one's coming out soon. It's gonna be my room transformation. I've been posting on Instagram every day if you guys don't follow me on there. I am 5K away from 400K, so please, let's try to get there. I know it's quite a far away, but like, please be the one follower that helps me. And comment anything down below because I read every single one of my comments. Make sure to subscribe. We are pretty close to um, 1.2 million, not really, but hopefully we can get there soon. And if we do, I would freak out because that's insane. But yeah, I really appreciate you guys and I love you guys. And until next time, Peace. East and the west, I'm racking up on my breath. Uh, power on me, I'm feeling just like a Tesla. Too much treat, the smoke is making my chest hurt. Girl on me, I'm thinking I should arrest her.